in problem number 11, we want to draw the graph of f prime on the same graph as f. So I've already drawn up here a graph. This is the graph f of x, and I'm going to use a red pen here to draw the graph of the derivative function. So what we're looking for here are places where, uh, first of all, I want to say, okay, is there anywhere where the slope of this function is horizontal? And you can see there's maybe a place right in here somewhere where the slope is actually zero. I have a horizontal slope. But that means that the derivative actually is zero at that point. So since I have a slope that's horizontal right there, the derivative value is zero because the slope of the function is zero. Then what happens to my slopes? They are positive or negative from there. These slopes are all positive slopes, and they're getting more and more positive as I move to the right. So they're positive, and they're getting more and more positive as I move to the right. So I'll draw that in in red, that they're getting more and more positive as I move to, towards the right. Over on the other side, what's going on? These are also positive slopes, and they're getting more and more positive as I move towards the right. So they're moving up this way. Now, if I were going to be very careful about this, I might draw this more as a parabola and less as lines, but we get the idea that in both sides, it's moving upward from that point where it's zero. So it's kind of moving up this way, and it's moving up this way. So the red graph would be a graph of this function's derivative. Uh, it looks like a parabola. And notice that the original function looked sort of like a cubic function. So uh, we maybe shouldn't be so surprised that the derivative is parabolic 